in the likeness of God. You carry the very genes of Jehovah God, your maker. Your nature is in the like one of your creator. He said, what? I said, yes. Your nature is in the like one of your creator. Now he looked me in the eye as tears dropped down his left eye and said, you talk to me later. I said, I also thought because I knew the spirit of the Lord was working in him. And it cut me such as I see in the Bible when he spoke to the elders and the leaders. But she asked me, why did God destroy Sodom and Gomorrah? Genesis 18, 20. Because their cry was great and their sin was exceedingly grievous. Now, man will not appreciate a perfect picture painted by God that is out of the Eve, but man prefers a pen and Eve or Kwame Lane, Steve. Now, please, my mind, because two years ago, I met this pretty Christian girl named Chanel. You know, nice long hair, nice walk, gloves to play games, tickle, fit as a fiddle. And in our relationship, she said she just had this attraction for girls and that she was a lesbian. I said, baby, what? Lesbian for the Christian? Lesbian for the Christian? Lesbian for the Christian? I said, no, you can't be lesbian for the Christian. It just won't work. It's either you're a lesbian or a Christian. Now, even the laws of attraction slash magnetism say light poles repel, and all light poles attract. So how on earth was she attracted to the same gender and feel comfortable and think it was clever? Now, at that point, I wanted to help her rather than offend her. Neither did I want to hide the truth and defend her. So I told her, sweetie, just ain't right. Guess what? She told me what's over, slapped me and slammed on my face. I said, I, I wasn't bothered because I knew the spirit of the Lord was working in her. Today, my friend Nick, it's day to the same, you know, we get to marry next year, July. I thank God for the lives. Amen? Amen. But they asked me, why did God destroy Solomon and Gomorrah? Genesis 18, 20. Because your cry was great and your sin was exceedingly grievous. Now, man will not appreciate a perfect picture painted by God that is Adam and Eve, but man prefers a better and Eve or Kwame and Steve. No, I remix it. So they asked me, why did God destroy Solomon and Gomorrah? Genesis 18, 20. Because man will not appreciate a perfect picture painted by God that is Adam and Eve, but man prefers Adam and Eve. Now it's time for man to appreciate a perfect picture painted by God that is Adam and Eve and neglect and trash this stupid idea of Abena and Eve or Kwame and Steve. Dear Lord, I have spoken your words and I have done your work. So please smile at me tonight when we have a conversation. Thank you. Now before I go, my lady friend will join me here. We have a poem called So Ties. I would like to share with you. Amen. <laughs>